so sticky. You can get that off. <laughs> uh, actually, maybe you can. I'll get it off for you. <laughs> I can reach one. Okay. <laughs> okay. So let's talk through. Um, you know, let's change. Put your other foot out at me. Yeah. Because let's talk through. Like, if it's right here, okay. The only difference is you would still spray. If it's open, you would cover and spray. If it's right here, then you probably would want to maybe take a little thinner. Watch, I'm gonna just make this a little skinnier, just because there's not a ton of room. Again, you're kind of taking it halfway in and you're just kind of creating these little slits. And this is always a trick to find the edge, okay? So let's just say, you know, it's somewhere right here, or what if it's right here, okay? You would do the same thing, it's just not on the direct bottom of the foot, okay? So it's like here, 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 and like that, okay? Now this is an area where I might want to use a little second skin because it's not a direct zone. And so I might just kind of look at the shape I made. It looks like a bit of a circle there, an oval. And I just kind of create my little piece. You'll see this little blue film. That's got to come off. And then on the bottom of it, there's a white film. And that too will come off. And that will layer right there like that. And then you will take your... Now some people that I've worked with, they get super artistic and they make everything exactly the shape of the hole and you could do that. Or you could just do that. <laughs> okay, so it's really... And this is actually the piece of gauze I pulled it's pretty thick, actually. It's got about three or four layers, so I'm just gonna take that extra piece off. So now what we've got is now we've gotta get that toe wrapped up. So let me show you what we need for that. We need a couple different strips. So now we're gonna be making our strips around the size of the toe that I've got. You're also gonna make two little hats for the top of the toe. Okay, so the first thing we wanna do is just make sure, remember you sprayed, okay? But that kinda stays on. And then I do a hat all the way around for her toe, I just made that a little long, so I'm just gonna give it a little quick cut. And then, okay, so now I've got it secure. So now I don't have to worry about that piece of gauze falling off the whole time. And then what we're gonna do is go grab our second little hat that we made. I'm gonna make that shorter. And then I'm gonna cross it on top. Now, what we wanna do is we wanna try as much as we can to not come onto the bottom of the foot, okay? We wanna stay pure to the toe, okay? So here I kinda came down a little bit. You could have even cut that off there, okay? Because what we, we don't want is for them to feel the bottom of the foot that then this has a chance to roll up on them, okay? So then from there, we start kind of coming around. So you have the athlete like she did, just kind of spread the toe. Most people can do that. For people who can't, you either have them lean over and help you, or you just are kind of maneuvering around them. Okay, you see how here I've left a little bit out? I'm gonna go around a second time. So usually what I like to do are two little hats. I make a little cross on the top. 
I'm usually on the big toe coming around with two narrow strips. That way I cover enough of my surface area. I'm gonna come right down and just catch that. Okay, and then what we wanna finish with are gonna be two small little hats again. Now again, peep, there are some people, they get really artistic. I'm usually not one of them. But if you are, go for it. I've seen some of my colleagues will do this. They'll kind of make a little, let's see if I can figure out. Okay, like a little hat to create a little space. If you were good at drawing and making those like arts and crafts as a kid, this will come in really handy for you. Okay, so what that little what that little clip it, clipping did was what if it's too wide, it creates dog ears. Okay, so. That's what that did. It sort of got rid of that concept of a dog ear. And then again, I would come this way, wrap, and this way, wrap. So it was two hats, two around, two hats. Okay? And that's a pretty well protected toe now. Okay? The final piece of toe taping is you want to put lube between the skin of the toe that's taped and the other toe, okay? Because what we don't want is this toe <laughs> to rough up against the tape and then develop a callus or a blister or laceration or um, skin abrasion, anything on that toe. So we usually just put a little lube on the inside of the toe that's taped and the inside of the next adjacent toe. Okay, now we're done. Okay, so with the toes, you need lube. The bottom of the foot, no lube. Okay, so let's talk through.